a sneak comes back for another quick one. Another one on 3D printing, actually. Now, in the last video, I showed you basically some printers that you might be able to afford, you might be interested in, and a really cheap one that you may want to get started with. So you're saying, well, apart from designing my own things that I have no idea how to do, okay, we'll come to that in another video, by the way, <clears throat> what sort of things can you print? Well, anything you can think of, really, at the end of the day. Now, most people, when they first get a printer, they go to sites like Thingiverse, and I'm going to take you there now, and you can have a look at that sort of stuff. Now, I, one of my vacuum cleaners is a Dyson, okay, or Hoover, as we say in the UK. It's a Hoover, okay, or a vacuum cleaner everywhere else. Now, <clears throat> on the new Dysons, I'll be honest with you, they're not as durable as the old ones, okay, and bits do break. Now, luckily, on this one here, in Thingiverse, you can get spares, okay, among other things. So if I'll just quickly click on a few for you, and you can see what I mean. So if we go to, ooh, here we go, an accessory rack, okay. So with the handheld ones, you can get lots of accessories, okay, like this one here, like the bottom one, and all the crevice tools and everything else like that. And the print is already done for you, okay. And this is what it looks like. And you just go here and download the file, okay. It's basically ready to go. But you will need to put it through your slicer first. We've been through that already, remember? Slicing, okay. To make sure it prints okay. What else I hear you cry? Uh, right, okay. Uh, oh, this one up here was quite interesting. I might actually have a go of this, but I've not seen any printed models of this. Although, if I've looked on YouTube, and there are a couple of guys who've actually made one, okay. Whether using this one, I don't know. Oh, version 2, yes. We'll go to version 2 instead. Let's have a look. And see what happens. Oh, by the way. Thingiverse is quite slow to load, okay? It's quite slow to load. Now, is there any proper pictures here? Let's have a look. No. See, there's no pictures of anybody printing any. But would I give it a go? Well, I might do, actually. Might be worth the while, okay? And all you do again is click here to download the file, okay? Even tells you the things that you might want to use, okay? Now, obviously, this is not going to be as quiet as a real Dyson fan, but hey, entirely up to you. Uh, what else do I hear you cry? Well, a lot of people print models, so if I put a uh, bender, bender from you know where, okay, yeah, Futurama, there's lots of little models of bender, and this one here, I've printed quite a few of, not in that colour, obviously, it's a pen holder that goes on your desk, it's a long old print, a long old print, well, not really, it's about two and a half hours this one took me, so not too bad, but these are the sort of things you can print, and there's more down here, um, what's, another pen holder here, look, let's have a look. Just have a look. There's plenty of things for you to download. Basically, whatever you want to print, you can print. So, say you've got an iPhone. Okay, I'll, I'll type iPhone in. It's already there. Okay, I'm going to click Enter. And say you want a case or a holder or there's a stand here. It's an Apple Watch iPhone charger. My God, there's a wall mount. You know, whatever you can think of. Somebody's probably already made one. Remember, you can actually, if you really want to. You know, redesign it yourself for your needs. Okay, the camera phone stand here, etc. etc. There's lots and lots of things. That's all I'm going to say. There's lots and lots of places you can go to get these designs. Okay, bearing in mind that they're most of them are under Creative Commons use, and there are some you can pay for if you so wish. It's entirely up to you. Yeah, so basically, when printing stuff, it's whatever's in your head. Just either get one from Thingiverse or one of the other sites, or go and design one. And what I'll do, maybe for the next video, we'll design something really, really quick. Okay? Yeah. Anyway, nice little quick one. Sneaky Linux out. I'll see you later. Bye-bye.